All right, guys, what's up? So today's video is called Unusual Profits. It's pretty much exactly what it sounds like, making profit on RuneScape in an unusual fashion. If you guys like this sort of stuff, let me know in the comments if I should make it a series. And if we hit 600 likes, I'll have another one out Thursday. Also, just a quick note, this way of making money may seem normal to you, but may be unknown to others. The world doesn't revolve around you. God. What kind of unusual profit did I make for today's video? Well, it involves team capes. You know, the capes that everyone buys at one point in the RuneScape career from the dude in Edgeville. Well, did you know that there are nine other cape sellers around the wilderness like him? Yeah, we got William, Ian, Larry, Darren, Edward, Richard, Neil, Edmund, Simon, and Sam. All these homies sell team capes, each with different designs on them. Now, I thought potentially that these capes could be in demand, since some of these guys who sell capes are out there in the middle of nowhere, and not many people are going to go out to Willie just to buy these capes. Except me. Like I did for this video. My goal for this video is pretty simple. Buy one of each team cape, then sell it on the Grand Exchange to see what kind of profit I could make. Each cape costs 50 GP, and there are 50 different capes, so I spent a whopping 2500 GP to buy every cape. Most of these guys that sell the capes are pretty easy to find, but a couple took forever. Like Larry. F*** you Larry, you wandering piece of shit. The time and effort that went into finding Larry really just wasn't worth it. I mean, never mind. But in total, it took around 15 minutes to go and buy every cape. Really not too bad. So here are all 50 in my bank. Now actually, these capes look pretty nice, I'm not gonna lie. I'm just so used to the one that everybody buys in Edgeville that I forget there are so many different types of these capes. Except for the, the striped one that sort of just looks like the carpet in my bathroom. But I pretty much gonna do the same thing with all these, take them out by color and sell them and show you guys the profit that I make per cape. So the green capes actually all made me profit. I made a total of 5,636 GP from them and the most expensive one was the box in the middle cape up, the, up at the top, which I sold for 2,647 GP, which gave me the biggest profit of the green capes. The blue capes all made profit except for the X, the second one to the top. I don't know why, I sold it for one GP, couldn't sell it any higher. I made a total of 5,837 total GP off the blue capes, most expensive one was the 1500 scarab cape down towards the middle. The pink capes made me the most profit. I made 7,684 GP from them. And the most expensive one was the third to the top one, just the cross, which I sold for 3,000 GP, which was the cape which made me the most profit. The red capes made me a total of 4,447 GP. Most expensive one was the third to the bottom, the circle at the top one, which I sold for 1,923 total GP. And finally, the yellow capes made me a total of 4,852 GP. The most expensive one was the third at the bottom, the circle at the top one again, which I sold for 2,631 GP. So the team cape which made me the most profit was the pink cross team cape, which I sold for 3,000 GP. If I take away the 50 GP for the buying cost, it means I made 2,950 GP profit off this team cape. So technically, if I buy 28 of these, so a full inventory of these team capes and sell them to the GE for 3,000, I'm going to make 82,600 GP profit per inventory. That's not too bad. Now, which one of these team cape sellers is going to sell me this cape? Obviously, one of the 10, but who was it? Larry. Of all the team cape sellers, it had to be Larry. F*** you, Larry. But I had to do it for the video, so I went out, and after two hours, I found Larry and bought myself a couple inventories of team capes. However, they did not sell for 3,000 GP, and they didn't sell anything close to that. They ended up selling for 285 GP each, so... I did still make a profit, but it was not even close to what I thought I could make. I wasn't going to give up that easily, however. I went to the cape that I made the second most profit off of, the yellow cape with like the circle up top, which I sold for 2631 GP, and ended up buying 76 of these yellow team capes from Edmund, basically in hopes of making some sort of profit from these. So I went to the Grand Exchange and sold them. Now they all sold for different amounts, some sold in bulk for certain amounts, but at the end of the day, as you guys can see from the history, I sold 76 of these capes for 118,249 total GP. Now, if we take away the 2,550 GP that I used to buy the capes, it means I profited 115,699 total GP from these team capes. And that is my unusual profit. Now, obviously, this is not consistent money whatsoever, and I may have just gotten lucky with this profit, but I still found it sort of funny. I hope you guys enjoyed it. But uh, yeah, I wouldn't go out doing this for money every single day. Again, I may have just gotten lucky, but it was still fun to do. Thank you guys all for watching. Hope you enjoyed. If you liked this series, make sure to drop a like and a comment. Do appreciate it. Hope to see you guys for the next video. Have a good one, and peace.